See how easy that was? That easy. Mm-hmm. You see a title and you click right in. You click on it. See how easy you are drawn to negative vibes. I'm not, I'm not talking about my viewers. I'm not talking about the 10 toes down followers. Not none of you. I'm talking about profit no muscles. His followers and believers and those who follow him. See how easy clickbait is? And to my viewers who know, it's easy to be drawn in to negative energy, to negative vibes. Nobody says anything about the clickbait, lies and fabricated stories. And the saddest part is nobody questions it and continue to allow the deception. Talk back to me. Talk back to me early. Prophet No Muscles is no different than Adam 22, No Jumper, Vlad TV, and even Gully TV. Talk back to me. There's no difference in neither one of them. They're all the same. Clickbait. Every video this fool makes isn't what the title suggests. Every video. On top of that, every last video is about exploitation and showing only the negative parts of black people videos. Only the negative things they say. It might be a whole positive video. They just might be, yeah, now smack them. They're going to put that part up there. Oh, he's going to put that part up there. Talk back to me. He's going to put it up there and he's going to say, this person smacked the shit out of that one. He's going to clickbait you into it. And you're going to watch it. And you're going to believe it's the truth. That's a fact. You're going to believe it's the truth because you don't like your reality. And that's what's going on with a lot of us. We're not comfortable with our reality. So we want to live in fantasy land. We want to live on YouTube and fantasy world. Just like, see, like with Hassan Campbell, he told you, I got an army. Thanks for supporting. <laughs> thanks for supporting this war. Y'all know he ain't no goddamn army or a war going on. Everything is in his head. But you support it. Because you done made that your reality. Because your reality isn't working out for you. So you want to live in his reality. Talk back to me. I'm talking to you. Get in my comment section. Say something to me. I'm talking to you. Talk back. You may say, well, uh, 10. No one takes him serious. No one really listens to him. But if it's only about black ignorance, we should start to take him serious. Because he is a culture vulture. This is why I say I am one of the people who is real as it get. I'm as real as it come. Talk back to me. You know why? Let me show you why. They call me uh, a clout chaser. You only say his name to get your views. You this and you that. They say all of this stuff, right? If I was really, really out for views, subs, and money, I'm a great manipulator, so let me show you how easy it is to get it. I could get on the phone right now, today, and call Hassan Campbell, make peace, and start talking the same shit he's talking. Easy. I can do that easily. I could partner up with him. And wish the internet would be in the frenzy like, oh shit, 10 toes done went crazy. He done partnered up with Hassan Campbell. Y'all got to watch the video. It's going to get a whole lot of views. And then from that day forward, continue to push the same thing he pushes. Black ignorance. I start talking snack box rock uh, noodles and turnty. But I'm going to make my own name for mine. And y'all going to buy into it, the negativity. That's how easy it is. If I was really out. For subs and money and all that, it's that easy. That's how easy it is. I can go in on rappers and even talk about my story. Real stories. 
And I got some stories for your ass about rappers, DJs, and everybody. Talk back to me. Facts. I deal with them. Facts. Face to face, one on one. See, this man says I don't want to couch and talk about them. I'm really there in the mix. I may lose some of my followers, the positive ones who believed in me and, and believed in the struggle and everything, but I will gain way more. If I really wanted subs, it was clout chasing, right? Clout chasing. That, that word's great. Cloud chasing, I can rage war and talk facts that half of these YouTubers lie about. Talk back to me. I can report the facts of life, my life, those that I know. I can get the most ignorant ass motherfuckers. I know some ignorant, stupid motherfuckers. I can get up here and push it and you're going to believe in it because it's facts. And I'm going to show you paperwork and everything. You'll buy into it. That's a fact. Talk back to me. I can get up here and even show my murder case. Show my 21 years and talk about cuttings and fights I was involved in. I'm a great manipulator. A great manipulator. And know how to attract the people and have them buy into my true story. And even throw a couple of lies up in there. If I really was a cloud chaser and wanted subs and views, talk back to me. So you got to admit that, you know what? Ten Toes is not out for that because if he really was, he can really change the whole game. Like whack, uh, a wax doll, my man. I'll flip on him. Sonetta TV, flip on him. Miss 504, I'll flip on all of them. Flip on everybody. Go to Kwame Brown. Curse him out. Shut up, punk. You can't. You ain't got a jump shot. I just go crazy. Start going crazy on the internet. I'm going to get all the subs and all of you. Oh, oh, oh. Also, do a profit muscle move. Start clickbaiting y'all. Y'all going to buy into it. If I really wanted subs and money and views, talk back to 10. Get my comment section. I'm talking to you, sucker. But I come to you with love. Accountability. <laughs> accountability. Nobody likes accountability. I come to you with sympathy, empathy, and hopes of uh, making you vulnerable to open up and, and uh, put away the tough guy image in a negative mission that you have been on since you've been on YouTube. That's a fact. That's a fact. And I have yet to see him, Prophet Muscle, say or show anything when it comes to white issues or hate, such as Joe Rogan and uh, the black lives that has been lost to police brutality, to racism, anything with that. I have yet to see him make some clickbait in reference to that. And not one black culture vulture in the white community. That's what you're telling me. It's not one black white culture vulture. Only thing that we see is Karens and us getting killed by them. That's the only thing we see. We don't see none of us going into their culture, taking out of that and exploiting them. But they can come to us and we would embrace them. I guess it's because when white people argue or, or, or have some type of uh, disagreement, it doesn't end in violence. And that... uh. Y'all done brought into the, there are no white people in prison, I guess. And the Aryan Brotherhood is uh, one of the largest criminal organizations. And they go to prison for what? For what? There's no information, no story to tell about them. Only rappers kill each other. Not one country or uh, rock and roll artist has, has ever killed one another. Maybe not. The moral of the story is It's all your fault You The viewer It's all your fault As the viewer It's your fault As long as you continue To support clickbait Culture vulture And black genocide 
they will continue to promote it. And when I say they, I mean YouTube and any other name. Any other name. In closing, y'all know why Hassan Campbell makes videos about my son, Jim Jones, Mano, Fat Joe, and all rappers never seeking an interview or even a sit down with one of them or even doing the goddamn uh, the, the, the stream yard thing with one of them, in which he can get an interview with them easily. If he made peace with them all, what the hell else? What he have to talk about. If he made peace with every rapper. And told them one on one. This is the issue. This is what you need to work on and change. And since he got such a big influence. And every rapper made peace. What we have to talk about. Nothing. Nothing. That's when the work. The real work. Now he's going to have to get off the couch. And start going out. And putting the footwork in. Y'all's better pray I don't get the ball. I, I said it. Y'all better pray that I don't get the ball. Meaning people start listening to what Ten Toes got to say. See, I got 25,000 followers. Man. That's nothing compared to what people have and which they're not using it to build anything except their pockets. Shit will make this shit will make you cringe if I get the ball. You're going to be like, Ten Toes is... is. <laughs> he was serious about what he's saying. His mission statement is a fact. He's still doing the work. You see every platform have a relationship with me. Every rapper, everybody. That's a fact. Talk back to me and stop that goddamn white man prison.